Hello everyone, Cool Dude Cobra Mai here, back again with episode 4 of my Pokemon Heart Gold Nuzlocke, randomized. Uh, between the past couple episodes, I did do some grinding, uh, so I think I got everyone up to level 12, including Failure, the newest member of our party. Uh, he has not learned any new moves yet, seeing as how he is a Magikarp, but he still has extra sensory, which I don't think he normally gets. So yeah, it's uh, pretty interesting, to say the least. Uh, today we will be taking on the Slowpoke Well, and then depending on how much time we have left, we might go battle the Gym Leader Bugsy. So let's go ahead and head on over to the Slowpoke Well. The uh, Slowpoke Well isn't too hard. We do get an encounter here, so I should probably check to make sure I have Pokeballs. There we are. Uh, I got four. I'm going to go pick up a few more, because just... I don't want to fail an encounter, especially if it's something good. So yeah, let's go ahead and swing on in here and pick up some Pokeballs. Uh, Alright, we still can't get any of the good ones. That makes sense though, considering we uh, we haven't beaten the Gym Leader yet. We should get access to Great Balls after we beat Bugsy though, so that's cool. Alright, so yeah, we're going to head into the well, and uh, this is a pretty easy segment of the game. It shouldn't take us too long, maybe 15 minutes or so. All right, so there's Kurt. Hello there, Noah. The guard at the top took off when I shouted at him, but then he, but then I took a tumble down the well. I slammed down here hard on my back, so I can't move. Rats! If I were fit, my Pokemon would have punished them. Ah, uh, it can't be helped. All right. All right, cool. It's actually surprising that he didn't die, considering he fell from that high. All right, so we got a Rocket Grunt right here. First one in the game, actually. So this is the one that the guy knocked down. Alright, Designer Grunt with Turtwig. That is, uh... I should probably not stay in on that, so I'm going to go into Sun here. Everyone's the same level now, so I don't have to worry about over-leveling. Or, uh, switching into specific Pokémon. The speed-up function really helps, so... We're gonna take this thing out easily. Just like that. And then Gyarados. We actually don't have an electric type move, so uh, let's go into Oliver. I don't know if Gyarados would have bite yet, though. That's the one thing that kind of scares me. I think we can tank one bite. Thrash. Okay, that's uh, actually worse than bite. We're going to just keep using Psybeam, because I don't think that even if he crits, it probably shouldn't kill, so. Alright, cool. It's gone. It's going down. Alright, nice. Very cool. I like to see that. 412 experience. That's a lot. Jeez. Alright, uh, this is not my day. No kidding. Alright, cool. So let's... Keep hiding over. I don't think we... Okay, never mind. Yeah, there's the encounter. Alright, what is it? Another Steelix. Why have I caught, found three Steelix? Just... Okay, well, I don't want to fight it because these past two Steelixes have died whenever I hit them, so... I'm just going to throw a Pokeball at it, then. If I can catch it, this would be nice. Two shakes. Alright, uh, I'm just going to keep trying to use Pokeballs then. Yeah, that should work. Eventually we should get it. Maybe. It's lowered my defense by two. I should probably switch out then if that's the case. Yeah, well, let's, we're going to switch out. Uh, let's go into Tunnel because he won't know any good ground-type moves yet. Just bind. Yeah, the one damage. Not to worry. Oh, wait, I can paralyze it now, can't I? Wait a minute. It's... Okay, that's right. It's, uh... Steelix is a ground-type, I forgot. So, because Glare has 100% accuracy, does it not? 
Oh, it only has 75. I'm going to try one more paralysis. There we go. All right, sweet. Nice. That's good. All right, so I'm going to just throw the Pokeball at it now since it's paralyzed. Not even one shake still. This might take a while. Oh, hold on a minute. Okay, yeah, that's that's better. I'm probably going to have... Alright, so I don't know if I'm going to edit this first part out, but basically, in case you missed it, uh, I started recording the episode, and then I realized that my uh, thing was in the wrong format. It was not sideways, it was horizontal. I mean, it was uh, vertical. And uh, we didn't get too far, we're just... We're in the Slowpoke well and we're getting our first encounter, so nothing exciting has happened yet, which is another Steelix. Aw, oh, three shakes. Come on, that sucks. Oh, well. I mean, just keep throwing Pokeballs at it. I might... Hmm. I'm just going to try a few more, and if it, if it comes to it, I'm just not going to waste any Pokeballs on it. Screech. Okay. Well, alright, I'm going to switch into the Magikarp to try to lower it. Some, oh, wait, never mind. He can't be switched out, because he is... Alright, well, just hopefully I can catch it then. Okay, well, the two screeches is actually quite scary, so... Okay, we're freed from bind. I'm just gonna... I'm gonna run. I was not sticking around. It's unfortunate that we failed that, but oh well. Alright, so yeah, this is the part... This is Cornberry. Alright, so yeah, this is the point that we're at. Uh, you guys didn't miss too much. Sorry about that, so... Yeah. Yeah, alright, I'm just gonna... Never mind, I got another encounter just by turning. Dodrio. That would've been neat to use. I don't think I've ever used a Dodrio in a playthrough either. Oh well. Get away from it. Let's take out this Grunt. With the Slowpoke Tails. <laughs> Designer Grunt. They're all going to have the same name, I just realized that, because their name is actually Grunt, and then their trainer class is like Team Rocket. Oh yeah, Hitmonchop gets in- not Hitmonchop, Hitmontop gets Intimidate. This might- it's dealing decent damage. There's no real reason why I'm using Diamond, I'm just- felt like using him. That was a good amount of damage. I'm going to switch out. Mm. We'll go into Rattle. Alright, Rattles. He withdrew. What's he going into? Arbok. Alright, so he just has a... Uh, he has two Intimidate Pokemon. That's weird. Alright, well, that doesn't matter because I'm a special attacker, so... I'll just take him out. The bite. Uh, let's go into sun. Getting a nice, uh, quite a few Pokemon are getting experience in this battle. So, all right, good. We didn't get the paralysis. That we didn't get poisoned there, so that was that was nice. All right, down goes the Arbok. Uh. Now nah, I'll stay in. We're a few levels above it anyway. We'll just take it out. Alright, cool. It's down. Sun's gonna level up. Almost two level ups. Not bad. Alright, cool. Uh... 
Do I have any healing items? Alright, I have a super potion, but I'm not going to use that yet. Then what normal items do I have, actually? Lax Incense, Heat Rock, Sunny Day, we don't have... Lowers the foe's accuracy. Who should I give that to? Let's give that to Failure. He kind of needs all the help he can get at the moment. Um, a lot of the stuff I just picked up while I was grinding, so... What TMs do I have again? Pluck off, knock. What's who gets knock off? No one. Or Giratina, but I'm not. I'm not gonna. It only has 20 base power in this game. That's really weird. Yeah, knock off only has 20 base power, huh? Very strange. All right, well, we have this one, and then we have the admin. I don't remember this the the admin's name. All right, designer Grunt with Vespaquin. Um, I probably should switch out then. Let's go into Sun. All right, cool. Oh, Gust. I won't do a whole lot, because she's six levels lower than I am, so. Let's just take, uh, Ember. That might kill. Nice. That's what I like to see. Level up. Another level up. Wait, what's he going to learn? Mock Punch. Yes, okay, that's perfect. Get rid of Leer. Now we have a fighting-type move. Grumpig. Uh... Hmm. Rattle. There we go. I'm just gonna send that out, and then I'm just gonna use Ominous Wind. It's a very nice move to have early on, because those boosts can really come in handy in tough battles. Snubble. That's just a normal type in this game, because Fairy's not in this game. Uh, I'll just stay in. Take it out real quick. Cut my attack. Oh no. Alright, Dragon Breath. Take it out. Nice. Alright, now we have the last trainer here, which is the admin. Uh, let's lead off with... Uh, let's lead off with Sun. He's really helping out. Alright. What do we have here? I'm awful labeled as the scariest and cruelest guy in Team Rocket. I strongly urge you not to interfere with our business. Alright, Proton. Let's take him out. He's got, only got two Pokemon. A Seal. Of course, he sends out the water type. I think Seal's water ice, so Mach Punch could hypothetically kill it, but I'm just not going to risk it. Uh, go into Oliver. It's got a water sport. I just don't want him to use, like, Hydro Pump or something in one shot. Well, not, not Hydro Pump, just... Water Pulse, maybe, at that level. Maybe not. Headbutt. <laughs> well. Starmie. Um. Yeah, my, I should probably go into Rattles. Wow, that thing's actually really high level. It's, uh, level 12. It's a lot better than everyone else in this base. Okay, yeah. Does he? Okay, he doesn't heal his Pokemon. 
And that's the game. Good battle, good battle. That's gonna level up. Rattles. Trainer Proton goes down. Team Rocket was broken up three years ago. Alright, so let's head out of the... Way to go, Kurt, Team Rocket. Okay, now we're back in his house. Now, I actually... Okay, he's gonna give us Pokeballs. You have Apricorns. I'll turn them into Pokeballs. Okay, I don't actually know how the Apricorns are gonna work, because I'm playing this on an emulator, so the clock... The internal clock doesn't work. Well, we'll just see when he calls us. Alright, we'll see. Alright, cool. Let's head out. I'm going to heal up our Pokemon, then we're going to go take on the gym. If I can go through the door. <laughs> and then I probably need to pick up potions too while I'm here. Dun, dun, dun. Alright, cool. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, wait, what's the second guy selling here? Alright, just the specialty Pokeballs in the mail, which I don't care about. Alright, so let's get some, not super potions yet. We'll get ten regular potions. Spend all of our money there, and when we clear the gym, we'll have enough to get, like, great balls and stuff. Okay, so, who am I going to lead off with? Let's start with, uh... Let's start with failure, actually. That way we can switch train him up. He can actually take out... He was able to one-shot some of the Pokemon that I was grinding uh, against in Ilex Forest, so maybe he can take out a Pokemon or two here. We'll see. Oh yeah, I forgot how much I don't like this puzzle. Um, I don't remember the right combination, so... Okay, that one takes you to the trainer, which is fine. I want to battle them all anyway for experience. <laughs> Ow with his Bastiodon. Alright, well I'm not staying in on that. We're going to go into diamond since this thing's quad weak to water. It's gonna, oh, just protect. Alright, then that's not as big of a deal. Protect again. Does it... I don't know what moves it knows at this level. Taunt. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to attack. Okay, this is actually a bit annoying. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, what? who am I kidding? Why did I try to do that? Metal sound. Alright, the taunt wore off. Go for another water gun. There we go, that was... That could have been really annoying, actually. I got lucky with the crit, though. Beldum. Uh, I think Psychic type. But it's also Steel type, so... I'm gonna switch Train Failure. And then go into Sun. And use Ember. Actually, I should probably go into uh, Rattles. Because... He's also, he's psychic type, so he could have confusion. Takedown. Oh, wait, no, it only gets takedown, that's right. I forgot. For some reason, that's the only move it gets. Oh, and we got the boosts. We always get the boosts when we kill the last Pokemon, for some reason. It's like the worst time to get them, because you don't get any use out of them. Alright, there goes, uh, down goes female swimmer Al. All right, and I, I gotta think this through. It goes up, goes over. All right, yeah, this this is the right one, I believe. Yeah, that, that's right. All right, let's take out this boy, Benny. 
Oh, he actually has a Pokemon you find in this gym. Uh, that thing is norm is actually poison type, so I can go for the extra sensory here. That's actually hilarious that he because the Togepi is always programmed to have extra sensory. So whenever I got the Togepi, it knows extra sensory. Porygon Z, that's normal. That's normal type. So we're gonna go into Sun. And we'll just use Mach Punch, since we can actually hit hit the normal types now. Oh, nasty plot. That that's a, a bit intimidating, so I'm glad I'm taking that out as it uh, before it does anything with it. 475 experience points. Level 15. And Silcoon. That's another poison bug type, actually. Let's go into... Hmm. Let's go into Diamond. Tunnel can't really damage that thing. Sending out the Silcoon. And we're gonna go for the Water Gun. Oh, and that thing's about to go down. Easy peasy. Good game. Diamond's about to level up. Alright, so we're gonna put on the lever. And that takes you to that trainer, which I don't know if I want to fight him, so... Uh... I think I have to battle one of them, actually. Because let me think. If I turn that off, I'm going to go straight to that guy. Alright, you know what? Fine, we'll battle that guy. Why not? Alright, what do you got? Female swimmer. What's your name? Josh. With his slake off. Okay, that thing's not too intimidating. <clears throat> Encore? Alright, I'm not too... I mean, I just keep having a chance to flinch if I'm just using extra sensory, so that's fine with me. And it has Truant, actually, so this is... one of the best Pokémon to grind off of for failure. Oh, it actually hit me this time. Hmm, hmm, hmm. All right, take it out. Nice. Magikarp actually re evolves really early, so I'm a. Uh... Yeah, he actually might end up being pretty good. Oh, and this is a double battle, isn't it? Okay. Yeah, it is. Okay, I don't know who. Who's the second member in my party? It's, uh, Tunnel, right? Okay. Bro and Sis. Okay. Um. Let's see. What am I gonna do here? Um. I'm gonna go into Sun. And then Tunnel... We'll switch into Oliver, I guess. Yeah. Alright. That's fine. Mega Drain. Who's he hitting? Uh, Sun? Yeah, okay, that's... Oh, that did nothing. Alright, so you're going to do Mach Punch on the Geodude, and you're going to do Psy Beam on the Vile Plume. <laughs> oh, and that thing goes down. Everyone got experience, and then the Psy Beam should... It probably won't one-shot it. Yeah, it didn't. Stun Spore. Alright, well that's not fun. Then just, I guess, Odor Sleuth. Alright. Sweet. 
Which one's the brother in that scenario, though? Okay. Let's head on over. I'm not going to go to the Pokemon Center. I'll probably just use my potions, and then I also have a Paralyzed Heal, so I can heal up uh, Oliver. So, we'll use the potions on Failure, and then we'll use one on Oliver. And do- I thought I did have a Paralyzed Heal. Oh, well. Uh, it's fine. I, uh, I'm not too worried about it. Alright. Let's, uh, let's take Bugsy down. We got God Bugsy. That's actually funny that all the gym leaders are replaced with God. Well, okay, wait. Level 17. That's... high. Um... It's holding a berry? It has a citrus berry. Alright, this thing's just setting up all the passive damage. If I get... Okay, depending on what her next Pokemon is, I'm going to use the Antidote to heal him from poison. Failure is going to level up there, so that's nice. And Sun might level up too? Alright, sweet. Level 16. He's... Venusaur. Uh, I'm just going to go into Rattle. Probably the best thing for this, because I don't really have anything to deal with a Venusaur. If I can get a Paralysis, that'd be nice. Critical hit. Oh, and we did get the Paralysis. Oh, but it got Sleep Powder. Okay. Let me just he... Not heal. Uh, no, oh, yeah. Uh, where's the... There, there it is. I forgot that the healing items are separate in these games. Alright, Vine Whip. That's not going to do much. Not very effective, that's what I figured. Ominous Wind. Just gonna keep Vine Whipping me. It's not gonna do a whole lot of damage, so I'm not too worried. Rattles is sleeping like a baby, though, so there's that. It's four turns of sleep. I was about to say, four turns of sleep and he hasn't been paralyzed once. Vine Whip. Alright, let's just take up this... Oh, the super potion. I totally forgot about that. It's gonna go for sleep powder again, isn't it? No, it's not. Surprising. Alright, uh... Oh, I have one more ominous wind. I'm just gonna use that, just so I have the chance of getting the boosts. Nope. And then we got sleep powdered. Uh, yeah, um, I'll probably just stay in. I just gotta wait until I wake up, which hopefully won't take too long. Not very effective. Two turns of sleep. I think five is the maximum amount of time you can be asleep. Okay, yeah, there. That should take out that Venusaur. Two grass types, and it's a bug-type gym. Kind of fits, actually, so... 667 experience points. Slash? Uh, I mean, you're not physical, but it's better than Scary Face. Ah, Alright. Blissey. Blissey's... Blissey's normal, so, like... I'm gonna go into Sun. I don't think that the Blissey can do too much damage, so I'm not gonna heal up. Probably. Yeah, because it has weak physical defense. This might this might just one-shot it. Okay, just about. Oh, and then the growl. Alright. 
So that's going to finish up the, the battle. Oh, wait, no, she has another potion. No, no, she doesn't. All right, well, that's the battle. That was actually close. Sun's probably going to level up, too, because those, those things give a lot of experience. That's what I like to see. Fury swipes. I mean, just get rid of Scratch, I guess. All right, there goes God Bugsy. The Hive Badge. Very cool. And then TM89. What's that? Because the TMs are randomized. It's not U-Turn. I'm going to bet you anything it's not U-Turn. What is it? Missed. <laughs> okay. Uh, eh. That's not very useful. Right, let's just turn this on and head back. We'll head back to the Pokemon Center and then I'll wrap up the episode. So yeah, that was a... Uh... He was tougher than Faulkner, that's for sure. But, uh... Yeah, Faulkner was a pretty much of a pushover. But... Bugsy would... Bugsy put up a decent challenge. Cool. Alright, let's go heal up. We'll heal up real quick. Dun, dun, da, da, dun. Okay. Alright, and that's just gonna do it for this episode. So thank you guys for checking it out. And uh, if you want to keep updated with the series, be sure to hit the subscribe button or check out the playlist on my channel. And that being said, I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.